another Jira Basics session. In this session, I'm going to show you, well, basically one of the things that probably you're going to be doing a lot of times, and that is exporting your issues. It's really simple. So first of all, you're actually inside your project, and then you get this task that um, you need to export basically all of the issues um, likely in the Excel so your managers can actually see this. So what do you do? Well, first of all, I believe that most of uh, you are actually using this new navigation. If you're not using the new navigation, well, get used to it because in July, everyone will actually have this navigation applied to them. What do you do? You're gonna navigate to this option right here where it says issues. All right, so that's good. Now what? So you have all of these options being aligned in here and you expect for the export option to actually be here. Well, no, that's not the case. In order to export this, you're going to see this icon here. But when you hover over it, you're not really seeing this option that actually says export. But when you click on it, it indeed does that. So what are you gonna do? So you have the, like the Excel CSV and you have the CSV. If you ask what is the difference here, I believe that this is due to the format, but mostly you're going to be doing this in the um, CSV. And what you can do, you have two options. You have all fields, or my defaults. So if we, if we go for all fields and we select all fields, basically. So this is what is it going to happen? So it's gonna, it's gonna download a CSV file and it actually took some time in here to load this CSV file. So now, in order for us to actually, well, um, let's go with the uh, Google Drive. Let's go here. Let's go to log in to the Google Drive. Let me just upload it in here because we have we have our CSV file in here. Let me upload it. There we go. It's doing the upload. Yep, it's done. And when we open it, we're going to see uh, this. So this is how is it going to look like. You're going to have summary, issue key, issue ID. You're going to have the issue ID as well. Yes, you have the project name, project type, project leads, project lead ID. Uh, project description, project URL, priority, all sorts, basically all fields. Now oh, this is a different one. All right, if I try to open in here, it might actually take some time. Oh, it didn't. There we go. Then you have issue types, then you have the statuses, then you have votes uh you have time spent original time spent and basically it's saying yes all the possible fields that are actually in there this includes the custom fields as well so if you're doing all of the fields be prepared to do some of the filtering here but this is how you export your issues don't forget to like share subscribe to the channel see ya bye